Hi everyone and welcome to All About Aquaculture, to Sula Kwakwetio Profit Africa. Uh, we are here today in uh, Lilongwe, Malawi, and we are going to visit the Apoti Feed Mill. I'm here with Mr. Uh, Griffin Rashid Kunji, who is the promoter of Apoti Feed Mill. Welcome to Apoti Feed Mill. We started in, 19, in 2021, December 2021, and I can show you, I can take you around. Our capacity is at 40 tons per month. Yes. This is our landing, landing point for our ingredients. As you can see, we got different ingredients from uh, maize, uh, soya, soya beans, soya, soya beans, sunflower, and the cassava uh, ingredients. From here, we we take them into the factory where we do the weighing and uh, mixing according to the ingredients, which we want, the percentages which we want. And what are those doors? I see the three doors. There. Those are the three doors are for the entrance for the gents and ladies. It's the washing rooms. So uh, the, uh, the workers, they enter through those ones. They change their clothes, put on their uniform so that they can go into the factory. Okay. Yes. And, and this door, this big door? And this big wall is for, for getting in the ingredients. When we are getting a bag supplies, we open those doors and bring the, the stuff inside here. Okay. And from where do you get the, the raw material? We get from the local farmers in the country, around the, the, around the long way and in change within the central region. Okay. And are there some raw materials that you import? Yeah, mainly the fish meal we do we do import from South Africa. What do we have here? This is our production line. Yeah, normally the ingredients start from the mixer, they go through the extruder, the dryer, uh, the oiling, and then the finished product goes like that. Okay, can yes. you show us? Yes. Yeah, this is the crusher. This is the crusher, and the, this one is the, the mixer. This is the mixer. Once we have weighed the, the intruders, we mix them into that one so that they go to the feeder. So this is the feeder. Uh, just, just stop the, we are changing the cutters. We are changing the cutters because the feed is not coming out nicely. So we want to replace new cutters. So this is the extruder? Yes. This is the extruder. You can see, don't get Don't get any bang on. This is the floating feed which we are making three, four millimeters. Four millimeters? Yeah, four millimeters for the four millimeters. So right. the cutting is not coming out nicely. Eh? So we want to adjust the, the cutters okay. so that it will come out nicely. Right. Yes. This one is This is the dryer. From the extruder it goes into the dryer. And the, where we do the, our drying. And the, this one is the oil. We, we inject oil on the on the feed, our feed to feed. Okay. So it's oil, you put the oil after? Yeah, we, after. Put, we put vegetable oil. This is the container for the vegetable oil. So we spray it inside there. So that and, and you spray yourself? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Using yeah, we use this sprayer yeah, for the for the oil on that side, okay. yes. Yeah. And then here. Yeah. yeah, this is the, se the selector. We select the different sizes from the extruder. We want our own sizes. So we use them. We do the, our selection here. And then the finishing product goes through the, the cyclone there. And then the, we do the weighing after that. Okay, we're weighing and yes. packaging. Yeah, weighing and packaging. And 
That's the whole thing. Yes. Can we see some of the fish that is floating? Yeah. This is the feed which is floating, you can see. When you put there, it's floating. And normally it takes about 16 hours to sink. So, 16 hours? Yeah, 16 hours to sink. For those who have already tried, nice. yes. yes. Nice. And, and what do we have here? Yeah, here is the stores for the spare parts, plus the spanners to serve it to the, our equipment on the outside. Yes, yeah. Yes, this is the parking area. And they're they weighing, park. yeah, they're weighing. And from there, we take them to uh, the storing area where they are ready for, for dispatching. Okay. So here, here they are ready for dispatching. The customers will pick it from this point. Okay. And the RCP content is 32%. 32%? Yes. Quick protein? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. and, and what is this, e this equipment, please? This equipment is a standby generator in terms of power supply. When the power goes off, it automatically starts so that the production line should not stop. Okay. Yes. Okay. And, and currently, what is the capacity of your feed mill? It's 300 kgs, but it does 300 kgs per hour. Yes. And how, how many tons do you produce per, per month? Uh, it's 30, 40 tons per month. 40 tons per, per month. month? Yeah, using two shifts. Okay. Yes. Okay. Nice. Yeah, thanks for visiting Apoche Farm. You are most welcome next time, since we are also going to install a bigger machine. Thank you very much for uh, watching this video in uh, Lidongwe, uh, Malawi, uh, at the Apoche Feed Mill. As usual, I will invite you to like the video, share it, and also invite other people interested in aquaculture to subscribe to All About Aquaculture to Sulawapicho, Thank you. Mwili Mwanji.